everyone welcome to my video uh, I want first off I want to give honor glory and praise to my creator my father in heaven and my redeemer uh, I'm gonna do a short video here uh, uh, some more about Prince Charles and uh, myself because I believe I'm God's chosen king for this earth the prince I should say because Jesus Christ is king Yeshua is king but anyway here's here's my my belief is that you have the right to worship however you want to you can worship idols you can be a Muslim you can be Hindu a Christian a Jewish, you know, there's lots of things that, you know, ways to worship. But anyway, you have a right to do that. However you, to worship God, however you believe, you know. And I'll fight for your right for you to believe and do whatever you want to, as long as it ain't violent, you know, a violent religion. But what I'm coming down to is Prince Charles has taken over the kingship of this world. And I'm going to do a chart comparison, a birth chart of him and me, myself. This is... um. Let's do his birth chart. This is his birth chart, uh, Prince Charles. It's pretty significant. There's kind of a, a red line right there. It splits the middle of the sky. But let's do, a, I want to do the shape so you can see kind of illustration of where the sun, moon, and stars all lined up to one side. That's pretty significant. You know, I don't deny that at all. Let's see his dominance. He is 55.50%, 50 uh, 56% fire. All right, that's pretty significant right there. Now let's go over and compare to mine. My earth is 56%, so I'm just a little bit, for the earth, I'm just a little bit more powerful than this man. And Donald Trump one time said to Mike Bloomberg, you can't win because you don't have the magic. Well, let me make, I want to make this very clear. I don't consider it magic, but let me say, I'm going to say it this way. Donald Trump, I have the magic, and you know I've got the magic. Benjamin Netanyahu, y'all know I have the so-called magic that I'm more powerful than y'all. Um, there's no question about that in my mind. God put an image on my right thumb of a king. Um, it's not a tattoo. It's nothing like that. But anyway, I'm, I'm going to try to make this video quick because my things. I was born September 8, 1961 at 23, 11.55. The general time was 555. Um, but let's go over here to my birth chart. You can tell these are... Uh, there's patterns in these birth charts. That's what my chart is. There's Jupiter and Saturn. I've been in a war my whole life with Saturn. You know, it's it's there to uh, teach me. It's it's a strict teacher. Saturn is a strict teacher, um, and that's my birth chart. Really, kind of, it's it's a very strange birth chart. So y'all can see there's patterns here, and my kids all made my children all made these patterns too, kind of like this. But let's look at the shape here. I'll show you this. Give you what happened in the. the the minute I was born, there's a triple conjunction right there. There's a double conjunction. There's a double conjunction. That's where your character is being made. God is creating your character because uh, Nikolai Tesla said, if you want to know the secrets of the universe, think of terms of vibration, frequency, and um, energy. So um, there's a frequency and energies and vibrations being you're being created. Your personality is being created by the light from the sun, moon, and stars. So that's mine right there. And I'm, I'm doing this as humble as I can, folks. I really am. I've, I've tried to be humble my whole life, you know. I prayed since I was six years old. I went into my wilderness. I'd done the drinking stuff for a while and stuff like that, but I always prayed. If if I got drunk or something like that, you know, I would feel bad and guilty and ask God to forgive me. But anyway, I just want to do a comparison on them because I'm fixing to challenge these evil rulers of this world, and uh, they follow me my whole life. The night I was, the day I was born, they released a movie called Name Samson of the Bible. They, um, and things like that when I was born. So there's something significant to, I'm, and I'm, I'm not saying this like with pride at all. I'm just saying that it's time for us to step up to 144,000 to wake up, and my family to wake up and realize who we are. We have to step into a higher reality, a harder, uh, a harder goal for our creator. I mean, he expects us to rise to the occasion. And that's what I'm doing. I'm arising to the occasion. I'm ascending to a different reality. It's hard. It's almost impossible. And sometimes you just want to quit, you know, because it gets so hard and that you, you have to make king and queen decisions. And we have to do this for our creator. I know a lot of people think a lot of things about me right now because I stepped into a different reality, a more difficult one than you can imagine. But I, my aim is to do exactly what God has me to do. I pray not to be deceived in this whole process because it's time for us to take back our land, our country, our earth. 
my video's about over. Thank y'all for coming to my video.